The former Zimbabwean Football Association executive Jonathan Musavengana has been handed a lifetime ban by FIFA for bribery and corruption. He is accused of having a hand in the manipulation uh, of friendly international matches played by South Africa ahead of the 2010 World Cup. Musavengana has previously been implicated in match fixing allegations relating to Zimbabwe national team games between 2007 and 2009. 90 players and officials were banned for receiving bribes to throw matches. Earlier this year, another scandal involving African Cup of Nations qualifiers was unearthed. The FIFA ban will refocus attention on Zimbabwe, dealing a blow to attempts to shake off associations with match fixing. Despite two high profile scandals, authorities here have failed to convict culprits because match fixing is difficult to prove. He's always uh, said that he himself is innocent, that's what he says. Uh, but uh, even this year, he was given a second life ban by the Zimbabwe Football Association uh, for matches involving the national team against Swaziland, Nations Cup qualifiers. So the question remains, uh, how much still lies beneath the surface? We hear allegations uh, not only with the national team, but with the Premier League, and a lot in lower division football as well. Uh, maybe not uh, elaborate match fixing, but uh, of matches being sold, if you like, uh, teams uh, accepting money to lose or players accepting money to, to let in goals.